it's okay if you want to study outside your country or you want to get experience outside your country but then have you taken out time to know the pros and cons of such country you're about getting into yes in this video i will be sharing some benefits of studying in portugal but before i start i'm doris abedide i make videos about moving into portugal either for study or for visit and i also make videos about my life experiences here in portugal as a mother and student if this is the kind of content that you've been searching for search no more because you are in the right community yes and to my returning subscribers you guys are the mvip i can't thank you less you guys are wonderful because i see your comments i see your likes i see your words of encouragement hey they've been pushing me more to make more videos and to those who have been viewing and have not subscribed what are you waiting for why not kindly hit the subscribe button you aren't going to pay anything yes it's just to encourage me and to make me push forward okay yes thank you so much because i know you're going to do that right now yes thanks a lot so I will be sharing seven benefits of studying in Portugal and the number one I will be talking about is their teaching method. The truth is how knowledge is being passed into a student really matters and I've come to realize and understand that they teach you to be independent. They want a situation whereby what you are being taught in the classroom you can practice it when you are in the real life situation why did i say so for example as a master student you have to take nine courses in the semester in each of the courses at the end of it all you are going to make a presentation yes it is compulsory that at the end of it all you are going to make a presentation so as a student when you have it inside of you that you are going to make a presentation you have to buckle up so if the lecturer or the professor have been passing out knowledge into you then know at the end of it of the course you also as a student you are going to give report about the lecturer so they want to do their best to pass our quality knowledge into you so in as much as they are teaching you they want to give you the best so that you as a student can also write good report about them and another advantage about their teaching method is as a student you have full control of the courses you want to take so if you want to take your courses in bits you're free to choose and write your exams when you choose to write they have periods at which they write their exam so as a student you can choose whichever periods or time that you want to write your exam so it makes it easier for you as a student to get quality knowledge and not bugging yourself into trying to learn five subjects or four subjects all at the same time another benefit is the low tuition fee i think portugal is one of the countries who pay low tuition fee because you can get a school for at least 2500 euros per section in portugal and the government have made it easier for students in such a way that they can pay instrumentally that is they can divide their school fees into 10 equal parts for example a student who is paying 2500 000 euros per section can pay 250 per term and you know you don't even have to pay your school fees even before getting your visa another benefit is study and work i have received several mails from prospective students asking if they are 
allowed to work and study at the same time and i have made a video in respect to that you can see the link either here or there so as a master student or a phd student you can work you are permitted to work for a master student you are permitted to work for 20 hours in a week while the phd student is having a working visa the moment he or she comes into the country okay so watch my video if you have not watched it i explained it clearly in the video the fourth benefit is family reunification as a student you can apply for family reunification after you must have obtained your resident card yes i have shared my story on how i migrated from nigeria to portugal if you have not watched the video you can see the link above here so just click and watch it and you will hear how i migrated to this country the fifth benefit is access to european countries so as a student the moment you obtain your resident card you can have access you can travel to any european countries that you wish to travel to so you want to go to germany you can go to germany italy poland anywhere you want to go to europe as long as you have your resident so the sixth is learning portuguese language for the fact that you're coming down to portugal to study you are going to take a course in portuguese language so as a student you have the privilege of learning portuguese the basic language you're going to learn how to speak the basic so it's an added advantage because we have countries many countries that speaks portuguese language we have the angola we have the brazil we have the cape cape Verde, we have the mozambique and guinea bissau etc so it's a global language and it will be a added advantage for any student coming into portugal finally as a student you have access to some grants be you a master student and a phd student for the master student you must have spent a year before you can have access to some grants i will be sharing some of these grants or scholarship in my upcoming videos so kindly watch out for the video if you have been getting values from my videos and you have not subscribed what are you waiting for it's just a way to encourage me and make me push up okay just kindly hit the subscribe button press the post notification so that you would always see my videos whenever i make upload thank you so much for watching bye Ciao!